If you're a gamer on the go, you'll need a good gaming laptop that can keep up with you. In this video, we break down the top 5 gaming laptops on the market this year based on price versus performance and situations they'll be used in. So whether you're looking for a gaming laptop with true portability, or just the best gaming laptop you can buy, we'll have an option for you. So if you're interested in finding out which gaming laptop will be best for you, stay tuned. All the links to find the best prices on all the products mentioned in this video will be in the description below. The products mentioned in this video are in no exact order, so be sure to stay tuned till the end so you don't miss anything. First up, the Razer Blade 14, our pick for best 14-inch gaming laptop. The Razer Blade 14 brings a premium build, super portability, and AMD CPU power to a size and component sweet spot that makes it the best 14-inch gaming laptop available right now. This gaming laptop has an all-black aluminum chassis and is accented with Razer's signature bright green illuminated logo on the back of the laptop. The chassis is just 0.66 inches thick and weighs just 3.92 pounds, so you'll be able to easily carry it around in your backpack. The keyboard offers a comfortable typing experience with just the right amount of key travel and spacing. Some gamers might want to go with a mechanical keyboard instead, but there are plenty of ports available if you want to go that route. The highlight of this laptop is definitely the 14-inch, 165Hz QHD display. While a lot of faster refresh rate displays will usually cut corners when it comes to color accuracy or brightness, you'll get 111% coverage of the sRGB spectrum, as well as an average brightness of 332 nits, giving you the best of both worlds in fast gaming and an ultra-clear display. For a slightly higher price, you can get increased performance and a larger display with the Razer Blade 15 Advanced, coming up later in the video. Hardware includes an AMD Ryzen 9 processor, an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 graphics card for stunning visuals and realistic ray-traced graphics, 16 gigabytes of RAM, along with a super fast SSD at a whopping one terabyte capacity. Looking at performance, the Razer Blade 14 is ready to tackle AAA games, comfortably delivering frame rates above 60 FPS at 1440p. Far Cry 5 averages 84 frames per second, while Rise of the Tomb Raider averages 87 FPS. In some cases, ray tracing and other extras may exceed the GPU's 165 FPS limit, but that can be resolved by turning the resolution down to 1080p. If you're looking for a premium gaming laptop with a sturdy build that's highly portable, the Razer Blade 14 is an excellent choice for you. It comes at a higher price point, but the combination of its high-end GPU with the AMD processor makes it ideal for anyone who wants a great gaming experience. Next up, the Asus ROG Zephyrus G15, our pick for best overall gaming laptop. The Asus ROG Zephyrus G15 gaming laptop shares a few similarities with the Razer Blade 14. Both have the same CPU and GPU, but the G15 has a larger chassis and display, and some other enhancements under the hood that make it perfect for gaming. The G15 is pretty thin and weighs 4.19 pounds, just a bit more than the 3.92 pounds of the Razer Blade 14. The IPS display measures 15.6 inches and boasts both 1440p resolution and 165Hz refresh rate for buttery smooth motion. The audio system has a total of six Dolby Atmos-powered speakers, including a pair of woofers in the palm rests and top-firing tweeters that sound great by laptop standards. The keyboard isn't a full-size deck with a numpad, but given the option between the top-firing speakers taking up the sides of the keyboard or squeezing in a 10 key on a gaming laptop, the speakers definitely win every time. As mentioned off the top, the AMD Ryzen 9 processor and NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 are similarities between this laptop and the Razer Blade 14 but the G15 adds 40 gigabytes of RAM to the mix to run your game smoothly, as well as a 2 terabyte SSD for massive amounts of storage. Between the Ryzen 9 CPU and RTX 3070 GPU, the G15 just crushes it on the performance front. In Total War Three Kingdoms, the G15 pushes out 164 frames per second on low and 65 frames per second on ultra settings. In Metro Exodus, it scores an average of 125 frames per second on low, 61 FPS on ultra without ray tracing, and 52 FPS on ultra with ray tracing turned on. In Dirt 5 on ultra low settings without ray tracing, the G15 hits 125 frames per second, 73 FPS with ultra settings and no ray tracing, and 61 FPS with ultra settings and ray tracing turned on. If you're searching for a gaming laptop with true raw power, Asus ROG Zephyrus G15 is one of the most powerful gaming laptops going right now and is an excellent choice for you. Next, the Acer Nitro 5, our pick for best budget gaming laptop. The Acer Nitro 5 is built for budget gamers and delivers a solid gaming experience without breaking the bank. Design-wise, the Nitro 5 has a bit of a subdued look, but speaks to its gamer pedigree with some red flourishes on its keyboard, rear bar, and trackpad, as well as its red backlit keyboard. 
Because it's a budget laptop, some cost-saving cutbacks have been made. The build is almost completely plastic, and the display is framed by some thick bezels. But to save a few bucks, these are concessions that aren't too difficult to move past. In addition to its red backlight, the keyboard features highlighted WASD keys, and it's pretty fast and responsive. And really, when it comes down to it, that's all that matters, whether you're gaming or just typing. The 15.6-inch IPS display is clear and crisp, and has 1080p resolution, but it doesn't score high marks in vibrance or overall brightness. Computing hardware includes an Intel i5 processor, an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050 graphics card with ray tracing cores, tensor cores, and streaming multiprocessors that support DirectX 12 Ultimate. 8GB of RAM is installed, and for file and app storage, you get a 256GB SSD. Running at 1080p, you'll get frame rates of 40 to 50 frames per second on Cyberpunk 2077 with a good slash ray tracing medium setting, 40 to 60 FPS on Red Dead Redemption 2 at the balanced graphics settings, and 110 to 120 frames per second on Grand Theft Auto V at medium graphics quality. So you'll be able to play all the latest and greatest games on the Nitro 5, but you might have to make some adjustments in terms of graphics settings with some games. The Acer Nitro 5 is a good, cheap gaming laptop that offers mid-range performance and is a great choice for gamers who don't want to pay for the highest resolutions or frame rates, but still want to be able to play all the latest PC titles and get ray tracing thrown into the mix as well. If you're interested in updated pricing on any of the items mentioned in this video, be sure to check out the links below. Prices update on these products almost daily with sales and general price drops, so if you want to find the most updated information, check the description. If you find this video helpful, please help out the channel by giving this video a like and tell us which product caught your eye in the comments below. Next up, the Razer Blade 15 Advanced. I know we already mentioned the Razer Blade 14, but there are some key differences that make the Razer Blade 15 Advanced model a unique product worth mentioning. For example, it is built for gaming and comes with a powerful CPU, GeForce RTX graphics, and a high refresh display that delivers a top-notch gaming experience. The Razer Blade 15 Advanced features a streamlined build that remains one of the sleekest among gaming laptops in terms of style, quality, and portability. The all-black finish, sharp edges, and clean look create a striking silhouette that's often emulated by its competitors, weighing in at 4.4 pounds, and it's just 0.67 inches thick. The keyboard may not be groundbreaking, but it has a balanced amount of travel and feedback that's neither too mushy nor too resistant and the keys are individually backlit with customizable RGB lighting that you manage using the included Razer Synapse software. The display, on the other hand, does offer some exciting attributes, including 360Hz refresh in a 1080p display, which is perfect for competitive gaming. The core components of this gaming laptop include an Intel i7 processor for all-out gaming performance and the ability to run the most intense AAA titles without breaking a sweat, and an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080 GPU that delivers ray tracing and greater overall throughput. And like the Asus ROG Zephyrus G15, the Razer Blade 15 Advanced piles on 32GB of RAM and a 1TB SSD. If you're looking for a slightly higher spec and a 17-inch display, have a look at the Alienware M17 R4 coming up later in the video. For gauging performance, full retail video games are a good benchmark. Running Far Cry 5, the Razer Blade 15 Advanced netted 113 frames per second at normal settings and 109 FPS at high settings, and with Rise of the Tomb Raider, the results were 156 FPS with the medium preset and 133 FPS at very high preset. To keep the inner workings cool, the Razer Blade 15 Advanced uses vapor chamber cooling that quietly and efficiently dissipates heat through the evaporation and condensation of an internal fluid, keeping it running smoothly and coolly even under intense loads. The Razer Blade 15 Advanced represents the peak of today's premium gaming laptops and is an excellent choice for you. It's portable, powerful, and slick, and unmistakably built for high-performance gaming. Finally, we have the Alienware M17 R4, our pick for best 17-inch gaming laptop. The Alienware M17 R4 is the pinnacle of gaming laptops, and its premium build, searing frame rates, and mechanical keyboard set it apart from everything else. The Alienware M17 R4 is a gorgeous laptop. The lid of the laptop is all white, with an RGB Alienware logo. The theme is repeated on the keyboard deck, which is also white and has a stunning look. The incredibly responsive keyboard features 1.7mm travel with optional 4-zone RGB N-key rollover and anti-ghosting technology. The display is simply out of this world. It's a 17.3-inch 1080p panel with a fast 144Hz refresh rate and G-Sync support. It's quite bright at 300 nits and covers 72% of the sRGB color spectrum, so the speed of the display doesn't come at the expense of image quality. Your games will look crisp, colorful, and bright, even while you're hitting frame rates that will have you topping the leaderboards. Internals include an Intel i9 processor backed with an NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3080 GPU 
32 gigabytes of RAM, and a 2 terabyte SSD. This is an absolute powerhouse of a gaming laptop. No matter what game you throw at it, ray tracing or no ray tracing, you'll get extremely solid performance all around. Even in Watch Dogs Legion, which has trouble running on a lot of full desktop gaming PCs, is able to hit a solid 75 FPS with ray tracing on the ultra setting. In Metro Exodus, the M17R4 put out 78 FPS with RTX and DLSS on, and 90 FPS with RTX off. So you'll get more than enough performance to play resource demanding games with all the eye candy enabled, which is a pretty uncommon thing among gaming laptops, especially when ray tracing is involved. If you're looking for the best of the best, the Alienware M17R4 is the best choice for you. While it's on the more expensive side, you can be sure that you're getting the best quality and performance possible in a gaming laptop right now. Alright guys, that's all for now. Like I mentioned earlier, links to the best pricing on all items mentioned in this video will be in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please go ahead and leave a like. If you're new to the channel and you like the video, consider subscribing. We do our best to keep you up to date with the best products on the market right now, so if you want to stay current regarding the best gear, make sure to hit that subscribe button. Hope you all have a great day, and we'll see you back here soon.